This training tip is brought to you by these fine sponsors. Welcome to this week's training tip. This week, we're gonna teach you how to do directional casting with your dog in the water. Earlier this season, we did what we called baseball, which was on land. We showed directional casting on a left over command, a right over command, and a directional back command. Today, we're gonna to take that to the water and go to one of our training ponds where third base will be just off the shore in the water, second base will be just off the shore in the water, and first base is gonna be in the open water. We've got a dog, his name is Tom. Say hi, Tom. Tom has been through our directional casting at here at our kennel side acres retrievers. We're now going to use that and apply that in the water. Step one is to establish second base or your back pile. This back. is going to be throwing bumpers across the pond to where you want your second base to be and just sending the dog on simple retrieves. During this section of training, we're going to do this about five times. Step two is going to be stopping Tom on the pitcher's mound, which is actually out in the water. Once we get Tom stopped, we're going to give him a directional Stand back cast back. so that we can teach him that he is indeed going to listen to our commands and be handled in the water. Step three, we'll be throwing out three bumpers, one to third base, one to second base, one to first base, sending him several times, sometimes stopping him and giving him different directional casts to the left, right, or back. And the final step is putting it all together. Now, when you are stopping the dog in the water, just like on land, you want to send them so that they go all the way through without stopping them about three times before you stop them. Just continue this, increase the size of your bumper piles, and you can have a lot of fun with your dog during summer. That's this week's training tip. Now back to the hunt.